within the first sort of first week, um, she was sitting, lying down, fetching a ball, um, and coming to a to a hand signal when she was called. I think that it's it's certainly something that could you know could help a, a lot of people if they if they have puppies that are deaf, mm -hmm. um, but also really useful for using uh, for dogs as they're going through the age process as well. So. Mm -hmm and geriatric dogs that need that little bit more, um, it would be great for them also. We counted last night actually and we thought that it was between 8 and 10 symbols that we use on a day-to-day -day basis. Okay. Um, but it's actually growing all the time. Well, well hopefully we're going to be able to extend and, and, and do quite a lot of progression with her. Mm. At the moment, you know, the key things is keeping pugs happy um, and motivated. Mm -hmm. um, so we'll just have to sort of see now, but we'd really like to be able to use her in some of the displays that we do with Fun for Dogs. Mm -hmm. um, and I'd really love to be able to use her for the seminars and educational programs that I do both with adults and children. Mm -hmm.